Look at them come right here. I have to lower it down to them. All right, guys, we're scoping fish in the canals. We're giving you a strategy for the pre-spawn. And that is to find the deep canals on your lake, the deep, deep creeks. And uh, these fish are going to be following those back to these spawning areas. So all I'm doing today is, just got a bite there. All I'm doing today is uh, taking my Savage and we're scoping fish in these deep, deep, uh, parts of the lake. Now don't pay attention to that. Uh, eh, actually, it isn't correct right now. The actual depth of the water I'm at right now is 20 foot. And we're fo following these uh, deep creek channels back to the spawning areas. Now, it's not to say that they aren't on the shallow, in the shallows right now. Some of them are, for sure. Some of those big mamas are always in these canals uh, and they are here for a while. They're sitting out here just waiting to go in there when the water temperature just, is just perfect. And right now we're sitting at 58 degrees, as you can see. And so I always in, encourage people, go to your canals that are leading back to those spawning areas, especially these times of the year in the Midwest. Um, and you're gonna find a lot of fish that are just sitting out here, ready to be caught. Good sized fish too, good sized fish. There we go. Good solid eater. Oh man. We need to find them bigger, but that is a great start. And we are gonna collect fish today. We're gonna get a limit in the boat, show you that this is completely uh, easy technique, guys. Seriously, this time of year, it's just follow those creek channels all the way back to the uh, spawning areas and you're gonna find yourself a lot of nice, nice fish. I mean, especially you run into some really large ones. Um, they tend to run in packs, let me just tell you. So we're just looking for those single, those single uh, fish there, and we're just scoping them. There's a good target. go middle of the canal guys out here where all the boat traffic is at. There's one there. He was supposed to be bigger. He definitely looked bigger. So guys, a lot of times what I will like to do is add some of this glitter from this walleye version of the bait pop right here. Now look, check that out. Adding that color, getting that scent down to the fish, adding that sparkle to that jig. So let's check that out right there. I've been using the heck out of this walleye version. Right there guys, bait pop, walleye. And it just adds massive glisten. And also, I mean, obviously it gets the the scent right down to the fish. So let's check this out. Yeah. 
Does Bay Pop get the big fish so far? <laughs> Good night. Sometimes that's how it works out, man. You put Bay Pop on, you're gonna get the biggest fish <laughs> up to this point anyway. Bay Pop, check it out, guys. Yeah, check it out, guys. Bait pop, legit, no joke. Great fish right there. Fantastic. Oh, <laughs> that's fun. Fish on the stump right there, boys and girls. Nice black crappie right there. Solid. 